I'm Sergeant Catherine Plows, and I'm the officer in charge of the Harbor Area Community Relations Office of Los Angeles Police Department. Actually, uh, Teen CPAB um, is an offshoot of our Adult CPAB, which stands for Community Police Advisory Boards, which have been around since 1993. In 2005, my senior lead, Officer Joe Buscaino, who is now uh, a councilman for the City of Los Angeles, came to me and said, Hey, Sarge, don't you think it would be a great idea if we could have a teen CPAB? And I said, Well, Joe, that's a really good idea. We develop plans with the community on a regular basis. You know, what's bothering your neighborhood? What quality of life issues are concerning you? The only people we weren't hearing from was the kids because many of the issues did relate to the youth, whether it had been graffiti, whether it had been truancy, curfew. It really gives them the sense that what they have to say is important. And nothing could be greater than empowering kids to think that the thoughts that are in their head what they're feeling about what goes on every day at their high school, on their street, um, at their baseball practice, means something. And to give them the, the tool and the vehicle to get there, that's the benefit. They're not all necessarily you know, straight A students or you know, top of their, their class, but they just have a genuine concern. It just warms my heart because I know that somewhere down the line I'm going to see one of these kids somewhere at the head of a corporation, as a, as a councilman, as a mayor, and maybe even as President of the United States because these kids have the devotion, the commitment, like I said, to make a difference. If I were their parent I'd be so proud to have them as my own. You have to remember that each community is not only made up of adults who go to work, come home every day, but it's the kids, the kids that are there that need a voice, they need to hear, they need to be heard, they need to speak. And so what better way for us as adults to recognize what's going on in our communities than asking, but then listening.